Hello guys, HD Gaming Champs here and today I've got a different video. I'm going to do a review of Freedom. It is the network I've been with for a solid since sep last September in 2014. It's now the 2nd of April, but I'm guessing this video will not be up. I'm not going to put this video up until I've left Freedom so I don't want none of this to come back at me. Because what I've got to say, there's some positives and there's a hell of a lot of negatives of partnering with freedom and I'm gonna say them all right now many of you may be thinking of partnering with them because they have such low requirements like 20 views per month and as low as 5 subscribers and there's a reason for that they just want you to show them the money Machinima have been known as a greedy network but it's just on a new level with freedom I'll be honest they have some good things their forums are a really good way to advertise yourself. Lots of people use the forums, lots of people are active on the forums, but the thing you're going to find on the forums is it's full of 12 year olds who play Minecraft. There's no mature gamers who will play Advanced Warfare and do some clouds with you. You want to do Advanced Warfare, you want to do Battlefield, you want to do FIFA, they're just all little children playing Minecraft, which is one of the downsides of this. I also posted a video on their forums to share it. it said post your gaming videos here. Posted it, day I got dislike botted. I got 110 dislikes on the video overnight. All from Philippines and weird country ass like that. And that is, uh, Freedom is based in Thailand. I thought I'd give them a try because at the time I joined, I had like 30 subscribers, 50 subscribers. Now I've got about 190. My channel was very small. I think I had like 7,000 views in total. And I didn't know what my earnings were with YouTube. After I joined, I looked on AdSense and there was £6, which I was quite surprised at. And then Freedom have been giving me something as low as 30 cents per thousand views, which is absolutely atrocious CPM. They promote themselves as one of the best at CPM with all these amazing sponsorships for small channels. That is one of the biggest bullshits you will ever encounter. I matched three, I matched it for Gat. Uh, Gamma Labs, I matched the requirements for that. I matched the requirements for Gamma Dias. Just as one way you needed 5,000 views a month, and one way you could just have a affiliate link. Five months ago, I applied for the sponsorships. Still no response. I've just got fed up of Freedom's absolute BS lies. George Van House absolutely stuck up his own ass in his videos. They really just bullshit their way to get money off your channel. And another negative is it's a 60 40 split. Fair enough, a few of Machinima or something, a massive network was going to promote your channel. Not when you have one of the smallest. Okay, they've got the biggest subscriber count out of any network simply because of the amount of networks they uh, partners they accept. I think they have something like 110,000 partners, and that's simply because they accept everybody. You have no requirements to join, there's literally no skill. You don't need skill to join Freedom. You've literally just got to be a shitty little channel and they'll accept you. No offence, people won't go and go there. If you want to partner with them, literally for their good aspects, which I'll say is their forums and the support can be quite helpful on the forums. When you open a ticket, they do generally respond to you in a couple of hours. They're like my only two positives. They've just conned me out so many money. I think last month I got 7,500 views all together and 25 subscribers and they paid me two dollars two fucking dollars and I got seven and a half thousand views I don't know what they're promising per thousand views but it is terrible this is just me being straight out honest with you guys I would not slag them off if they were good this is by the way the only network I have been with I've not been with TGN I've no requirement for TGN Curse, Machinima and Full Screen. I'm thinking now of joining Full Screen Oh, curse when this is done. When I get the. I'm, I'm 500 views a month off the curse um, requirements. I've got 7,500 last month. Need 8,000 views. And they're honestly just light their way into your pockets. I applied for five lots of sponsorships. Five months and still no word. I thought, yeah, fair enough after like a week. Give them some time to respond. Then two weeks pass, no one responded. Thought give them a week, three weeks, and it's just been five months now, and they just don't give a shit. 
They just promise things what they can't give you. They say they work for little channels. They really don't. They really, really don't. They're the exact same as every other network. They just want the shitloads of views. They promote themselves as a, cha a network for the little guys. A network for the small YouTubers who want to grow. They don't advertise your channel whatsoever. They offer a stingy freedom channel spotlight. And your chances of getting on that are so slim. I got on one and they literally showcased my channel for about two minutes. And all they did were really criticise it and go, good on you, good on you, but they don't tell you... Well, they criticise it, but they don't tell you where you can prove it. Literally, everyone they just said thumbnails. And I'm like, I make my own thumbnails. My thumbnails are quite good, I think. Um, honestly, guys, I just advise you to stay away from freedom unless you're a really, really small channel. If you've got over 100 subs and you can partner with someone like Curse. Machinima are even accepting low channels now. They've got free bands. I'd go for Machinima. Or Honestly, guys, go for Machinima. Go for some other network. Just don't partner with Freedom. That is my honest opinion. Try them if you really want to, but I'm warning you against it. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please hit thumbs up and subscribe. And see you later.